UK Travel Shakeup. New Electronic Travel Authorization Rules, BRP Essentials, and What You Need to Know for 2025. The UK government is making significant updates to its immigration and border systems, including the introduction of the Electronic Travel Authorization, also known as ETA, set to be required by non visa nationals by April 2025. These changes are part of the government's plan to digitalize border controls, impacting millions of travelers. In addition, the UK BRP, also known as the Biometric Residence Permit System continues to serve as an essential identification tool for residents. Here's what you need to know. Key topics discussed in today's video update. What is the UK Electronic Travel Authorization? Who needs to apply for an electronic travel authorization? When to apply for the electronic travel authorization? Duration of the electronic travel authorization? UK BRP and its role in the immigration process? Stay informed with the latest immigration news. Subscribe to our channel, hit the bell icon, and share our videos on Facebook, WhatsApp, and X with your loved ones. Let's resume the video and tell you, what is the UK Electronic Travel Authorization? The UK Electronic Travel Authorization is a new system designed for non-visa nationals who are visiting the UK. By April 2025, anyone entering the UK without a visa or immigration status will need to apply for an electronic travel authorization before arrival. This system is part of a broader strategy to modernize the UK's immigration controls and ensure smoother border management. Are you wondering who needs to apply for an electronic travel authorization? Not everyone will need an electronic travel authorization. If you are a non-visa national, such as citizens of the USA or Canada, you must obtain an electronic travel authorization before visiting the UK starting from early 2025. However, if you have a UK biometric residence permit or status under the European Union Settlement Scheme, you are exempt from applying for an electronic travel authorization. Are you wondering when to apply for the electronic travel authorization? The electronic travel authorization scheme is rolling out in phases. November 2024, nationals from the USA, Canada, and other non-European countries can start applying. January 2025, an electronic travel authorization will be mandatory for non-European nationals traveling to the UK. March 2025, European nationals will be able to apply with a mandatory electronic travel authorization requirement starting in April 2025. What's the duration of the electronic travel authorization? Once approved, an electronic travel authorization will be valid for two years, allowing holders to visit the UK multiple times, with each visit lasting up to six months. However, it is essential to note that having an electronic travel authorization does not automatically guarantee entry into the UK. Finally, let's tell you about UK BRP, understanding its role. The UK BRP remains a crucial document for foreign nationals living in the UK. It serves as proof of identity, immigration status, and work eligibility. Unlike the electronic travel authorization, the BRP is for residents and not for visitors, and it is required for those staying longer than six months, or who need to prove their legal status in the UK. Conclusion of today's video update with the introduction of the UK Electronic Travel Authorization and the continued importance of the UK BRP, travelers and residents alike need to stay updated on immigration changes. The Electronic Travel Authorization system aims to streamline border entry for millions of non-visa nationals, while the BRP continues to support legal residents. Both systems contribute to the UK's goal of creating a more efficient 
and secure border experience. That's all for our video today. Don't forget to leave a comment below and share your thoughts. Thanks for watching.